two, three. That shirt is outstanding, but you might want to just pull it back. You might want to like take it off. <laughs> 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 Put a different one on. Okay, I'm Marty Duda, and instead of at the 13th floor, we're at the wine cellar. It's the, pretty much the heart and soul of the Auckland music scene, wouldn't you say? Well, uh, we think it's the soul of the mu Auckland music scene. We're not from Auckland. And I'm here with Eben Sparrow. Ebony, welcome. Thank you. And um, you guys are just getting ready to do a show. You're on tour. We're here for the uh, sound check. We've been checking it out. You're going to play a song for us, but I thought... You were at my place just by yourself last time, so... Actually, Bryn was with me. Oh. We were a duo, but we did feel kind of naked, I have to say, in comparison to the full sound. Yeah. So maybe we can start out by introducing the whole band. Sure. So next to me down here is Chris Winter. He plays the trumpet. Hey, Melophone. Hey. <laughs> Melophone or Melophone? Phone. Melophone yeah. from 190-something. Four. Mm -hmm. and uh, he plays bass and electric guitar and is a beautiful backing singer, Chris Winter. Jason Johnson in the amazing yellow shirt. <coughs> <laughs> and <laughs> The shirt's the reason we came to K Road, actually, to be honest. I haven't found shirt. mine yet, but I'm looking for one. Uh, and he plays uh, bass and electric guitar. And uh, yeah, and then we've got Nick Brown on, on the real country shirt. That is a nice shirt. And Nick Brown plays uh, drums and uh, does backing vocals. And then behind me we have Bryn Havelt on uh, lap steel and electric guitars and good times. Excellent. Hi, Bryn. So you're playing the lap steel. Maybe we can just get a little... Uh, uh, tell me about the lap steel. How did you kind of get involved in it? Uh, really by accident. Uh, I just saw one on Trade Me when I was going through a, a fit of gear acquisition syndrome. Um, and uh, so I just bought it on Trade Me for 180 bucks, um, and it sat around my house for a year, and I was too scared to play it. Um, and slowly but surely it came out, and then one day Eb said, bring it to a gig, and I'm like, hell no, I can't play that thing. So I played for one song, played two notes, and then that's, that's how it started. This is actually a very exciting night for us, because we are at the wine cellar, it's the last night that it's going to be in this room, and then Rowan is putting it in another room, so it feels like a nice way to end it maybe, that we came, very cool. covered it in flowers. So and you've, uh, you've been on the road for like four or five dates already into your tour. You've done part of the North Island. Yeah. How's it been going? It's been amazing. It's been great. We've had some. We had yeah, a huge turnout in Wellington, which was great. Huge, actually, huge turnouts wherever wherever we were, even if they're small venues. You know, huge turnout in a small venue is great. Slightly squashy. Yeah. Hmm. Squashy's good. All right. <laughs> We've got a 17th date national tour to go with the album, which is called Sun Sun. Yep. And uh, yeah, Good it's nice hear. and bright, and you can't forget it. Why is it called Sun Sun? Um, nature and humanity. Right. Yeah. I, uh, but I get the feeling f from listening to it, it has a little darker sound than the previous record. Would I be right? That's the humanity part. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. All right. So you're going to perform a song for us. Yeah. And. It's, I assume it's going to be one on the album. It is. Let's have a little look. It's called A Mighty Wind, and it is. Uh, we're going to have a vinyl that comes out later in the year, so please, please go to our website and join our mailing list because uh, once it finally arrives on the shores of New Zealand, which is the last stop before Antarctica, it would be really great if you bought our vinyl. So this is uh, track five, and uh, we recorded this album with a lovely man called Brett Stanton, and... Uh, yeah, in Hawke's Bay and Tiawonga. And the last track on the album, we actually, I actually recorded that was Tom Healy, who did Tiny Rowan's album. Um, he's got a lovely studio underneath the Crystal Palace. So, yeah, there's a little bit of Auckland in this album, which is nice. Very yeah. Nice. Well, we're in the right place then. So, A Mighty Wind, is that right? A Mighty Wind. Very good. 